There's this really handy Google Chrome extension that I've been using that goes really well with the care quarter. And let me show you how it works in action. And to those of you who are programmers, you're probably going to appreciate this, especially if you're a Vim user. All right, so here I am on Google. And how about let's search for five recipes or something like that. All right, let's uh, go to this page right here. So instead of releasing my hand from the care quarter to touch the mouse, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep my hand on the care quarter and I'm going to type F. And when that happens, a bunch of these options are going to start to appear. So let's say I want to click on this first link right here. All I'm going to do is type A and J, and then it's going to take me to this page right here. Let's go back real quick. What if I want to open it in a new tab? So instead of typing F, I'm going to do capital F and then I'm going to hit J this time. And then if I look right here, it opened it on a new tab. So while we're here, so I can scroll with the letter J kind of like in Vim, or I can scroll up with the letter K again, kind of like in get Vim. So what if I want to go all the way down to the bottom of the page instead of scrolling like this with your mouse, what you can do is type in capital G and goes all the way down. This is an infinite scroll, by the way, so it's going to keep going down. But what if I want to go back up? Well, the command for this is GG, and it's going to go back up. What if, you know, there's a command that you don't know? All you have to do is type in the question mark, and then this window is going to show up, and it's going to show you all the commands, and they're pretty similar to Vim, actually, or no, they're all the same to Vim. I mean, even with find, you know, you have the forward slash to find something. And then when you want to cycle through your search results, you're going to use N or capital N, so on and so forth. So yeah, this is a pretty handy tool for those of you uh, Vim users out there. Um, you're going to appreciate it, especially if you use the care recorder. All right, guys, if you have any questions, let me know and I'll see you next time.